so guys in this simulation tutorial i will explain a bit about the interfacing of 16 cross 2 lcd with that of the arduino uno for it first we need to take our arduino uno so we will write here uno and here it is so we will drag it out and just put it there after it we need to write lcd and here we can see that it is the 16 cross 2 lcd okay now you can see that there are a lot of pins that's around like uh, 16 pins maybe on lcd and some gpios that is digital gpios on the arduino so first we will connect our lcd with that of the arduino so first we can see that our first pin is the ground on the lcd so just click on this pin and connect it with the ground of the arduino after connecting don't forget to arrange it out for good visual effect okay now we have connected it out then the next is the vcc pin so vcc must be connected with the 5 volt of the arduino we can connect it like that okay now the third pin is v naught and this pin must be connected with that of the potentiometer this pin is actually for the contrast controlling so we will connect the middle or wiper pin to the v naught pin of the lcd just follow these same steps and the other two pins the one must be with the ground okay like this one and the second must be with the vcc like it okay then the fourth one is register select or rs pin so we need to connect it with the pin number 12 of arduino so okay okay now the uh, next one is the read write pin of the lcd so we need to connect it with the ground so we will connect it with that ground we can connect it with any of the ground it is not necessary to connect with any special ground so you can connect it with any of the ground on the arduino board then enable pin must be connected with the pin number 11 of arduino Okay. then after we need to uh, we need not to use any of the uh, this data pins from db0 to db3 we will just use it in 4-bit mode like uh, first one is db4 so we need to connect it with the pin number 5 of Arduino the next is db5 so we need to connect it with the db4 pin of arduino the next is db6 so we need to connect it with the db3 pin of arduino or digital 3 pin of the arduino okay and db7 with the d with the digital two pin of the arduino
okay now we have nearly finished all of our connection that we need to do with the LCD and Arduino there are like two pins that is for the back end LED so we can take any battery like uh, like cell so we will use coin cell positive with the LED anode and negative with the LED cathode okay now our connections are complete now we need to go to write our code continue we will go and we will copy this code out delete all the previous code and paste it out and this code if this code you 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 can you can take it from the arduino ide in the examples like uh, so we will start our simulation uh, it is hello world but the LED is just right white is so uh, because i think that uh, we have placed our coin cell 3.0 volt maybe due to this thing uh, our LCD is working uh, still like uh, okay we need to we need to connect one one resistor okay we, we will just connect one resistor so okay we can just take one resistor and place it in between the in between the coin cell and and the LED spin so we will double click on this we will change it to ohm and we will just just write 100 ohm here now we will start our okay now you can see that our LCD is working fine it is due to the fact although in reality it is it is not going to destroy it that is the LED at a 3 volt but here we can see that okay and we can control the contrast with this potentiometer so here in this way you can interface your LCD with that of Arduino Uno so if any sort of confusion is there you can comment out and I will just respond in no time so thanks for watching.